Welcome to the Defeating Epilepsy Foundation YouTube channel. In this presentation, we will discuss what catamenial epilepsy is, the causes of catamenial epilepsy, diagnosis, symptoms, and treatment. Make sure to like our videos and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell to be notified of future videos. Please click on our donate link in the description section below and donate today. Your donation helps us to make a difference for those battling epilepsy. We appreciate your support. Catamenial epilepsy causes seizures to occur due to a woman's menstrual cycle and hormone levels. Catamenial epilepsy can occur during the perimenstrual, periovulatory, and ovulatory process, as well as the entire luteal phase and ambulatory cycles. According to the article, Catamenial Epilepsy, Definition, Prevalence, Pathophysiology and Treatment, around 1.7 million women in America have epilepsy, and catamenial epilepsy affects around 40% of women with epilepsy. Catamenial epilepsy causes seizures due to the menstrual fluctuations that include progesterone and estrogen. Estrogen has been found to have profound effects on the brain, while increased progesterone levels help to decrease seizure activity. According to the study, a clinical approach to catamenial epilepsy, a review, participants who received progesterone injections had a decrease in frequency of seizures in four of seven women. An electroencephalogram, or EEG, is used to diagnose catamenial epilepsy. MRI and CT scans may also be used as well to help locate where seizure activity may be coming from. Women are encouraged to keep a journal of their seizure activity, menstrual cycles, and temperature. By keeping a journal, it can help physicians see if there is a connection and a proper diagnosis can be made. According to Cedar sinai two types of seizures can take place when battling catamenial epilepsy, partial and generalized seizures. Symptoms of partial seizures may include jerky movements, tingling, dizziness, feeling full in the stomach, repeating certain motions, staring, confusion, and changes in emotions. Symptoms of generalized seizures due to catamenial epilepsy include convulsions, crying out or making a noise, stiffness, jerking or twitching, falling, loss of consciousness, not breathing, confusion, loss of bladder control, and biting of the tongue. Treatment options for catamenial epilepsy are anti-epileptic drugs, hormonal drugs such as oral contraceptives, natural progesterone, clomiphene, and gonadotropin-releasing hormone analogs. Other options are the modified Atkins diet, as well as surgery to remove the ovaries or removing the area of the brain where seizure activity is taking place. In conclusion, Catamenial epilepsy causes seizures due to a woman's menstrual cycle and hormone levels. Catamenial epilepsy can occur during the perimenstrual, periovulatory, and ovulatory processes, as well as the entire luteal phase and ovulatory cycles. Diagnosis can be made through an EEG, MRI, CT scan, as well as a journal keeping track of the menstrual cycle, seizure activity, and body temperature. Symptoms depend on the type of seizure activity that is taking place. There are many treatment options available for women experiencing catamenial epilepsy. To learn more about catamenial epilepsy, please check out the resources used in the presentation today. Please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on our social media pages. We would love to hear from you. Leave a comment below or email us at info at defeatingepilepsy.org. Thank you for your support and together we will defeat epilepsy. Check out our other great videos and subscribe today. 
you have the power to defeat epilepsy.